A couple of days ago, I received a parcel from Amazon. I opened it and found it was having a QR code or a barcode scanner module. So this is a MyCard embedded QR and barcode scanning module which can read small 1D or 2D codes. It uses the intelligent image recognition algorithm for reading QR or barcode data. The module has both USB and TDL interface for direct interfacing with a computer or a microcontroller. In this project, we will learn how to make our own barcode plus QR code reader using Arduino. This DIY QR and barcode scanner can scan the barcode or QR code and display the read information on the OLED display. You can use this DIY project in multi-purpose applications like product identification and inventory management system. So let's just learn how we can build this system. This video is sponsored by Altium. Altium Designer is the world's most trusted PCV design system for the last 35 years. Using Altium Designer, you can create a schematic, create a PCV, generate cover files and also make a bill of materials. You can create PCV designs with an intuitive and powerful interface that connects you to every aspect of electronics design process. If you want to get started with a free trial, click on the first link in the description. Welcome back again. So let's just learn what a barcode is. A barcode represents the line of numbers printed underneath with a pattern of black and white bars. Barcodes are designed for computers to read quickly by scanning red light or laser light across them. Each digit in a barcode is represented by seven equal sized vertical blocks. These are colored in either black or white to represent the decimal numbers from 0 to 9. Every number ultimately consists of four flat or thin black and white stripes and its pattern is designed so that even if you turned it upside down, it can't be confused with any other number. A QR code is a scannable barcode encoded with data. Encoded means converted into a particular form. In the case of QR codes, numeric and alphanumeric characters, bytes, and can be convert into a unique two-dimensional arrangement of squares. When an optical scanner passes over those squares, it translates their arrangement back into that data's original form. The patterns within QR codes represent binary codes that can be interpreted to rebuild the code's data. Let's see the sensor now. This is the MyCard's embedded QR code barcode scanning module embedded inside a plastic wrapped enclosure. Inside the enclosure, there is the main module with a camera and glass cover on the top. And it also has some cables and a few connecting wires. The MyCard embedded QR code barcode scanning module is a small 1D 2D codes reader. It can be embedded in any device for scanning code to identify other items. It can easily capture barcodes 1D 2D on labels. The module has the best sensitivity and high accuracy. And at the back, there is a buzzer that turns on when it scans something. The module has both USB and TTL interfaces for direct interfacing with a computer or a microcontroller. It is equipped with 9-pin terminal line and USB cable, which is convenient for you to convert between the UART TTL serial port and USB interface. This is a USB cable with a 4-pin connector that can directly be connected to a computer software. The module also has a 9-pin 4-wire terminal line for interfacing with a microcontroller. The red wire is the VCC which supports 5V, black is the ground, the green and white wires are TX and RX pins. The packet also comes with a manual that explains how to use this module in different modes. There are a few QR code in the manual to set up for conversion between TTL and USB interface. You can scan the QR code of the corresponding interface according to your needs. Now let's just interface this module with a microcontroller. For this, you need an Arduino board. I selected Arduino Nano here, and then we have an OLED display that can display the scan, QR, or barcode data. An Arduino Nano cable is also required for power and a breadboard for assembly. So you can purchase all these components from Amazon. I have shared the components purchase links on the website. 
Here is the simple connection diagram of the project. Connect the DX and RX wire to D3 and D4 of Arduino as we will be using software serial. And connect the OLED display to Arduino I2C pins. So this is my assembly. I used a breadboard to assemble this module. This is an Arduino Nano board connected to 0.96 inch I2C OLED display and also a QR scanner module. Let's just see the sample code now. We have used software serial for UART communication. The OLED library is defined by Adafruit GFX and SST1306 library. The baud rate of the module is set to 9600 and whenever the serial data is detected, the module will give the output data on serial monitor as well as on the OLED display. From the board, select Arduino Nano board and also the COM port. Then hit the upload button to upload the code. I have so many barcode tags here with me. I will be using these tags to scan the information that I need for this project. So let me give it a try. So as you can see, the barcode is displayed on OLED screen once the scanning is done. Every time I scan the new barcode, it displays the barcode data on OLED. You can also open your serial monitor on Arduino IDE and see the same value on serial monitor. The barcode data is displayed whenever the codes are scanned. Let's scan the QR code now. You can generate the online QR code using some websites and here I did the same. This is the QR code for our website which is identified when scanned. And this is my name displayed on OLED. You can also generate any other QR codes and display them on OLED using the QR scanner module. So this is how you can make your own portable Arduino based QR code barcode scanner or reader for multipurpose applications. All the information related to this project including the source code can be found in the How to Electronics article. If there is anything that you would like to ask, comment down in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.